Hey guys, it's Sarah with the Navajo Mama. So tonight's video is gonna be kind of different, weird. You know what I'm talking about. It's just my night routine. Basically, I guess just my face, like cleaning my face and what I use for my night. So let's jump into this. about my routine. I mean, no one would be curious. I'm just making this video just because, just because. Um, yeah, so what I'm doing is I'm just braiding my hair because I want to pin my hair back. So basically what I'm doing is I'm just putting my hair back like really quickly. I know I put my hair in my mouth and I know hair carries germs, but it's all right. All right, so now that I have my hair pin back, I'm gonna show you the products I do use. So in the morning, let's start with morning. In the morning, I use my morning burst um, cleansing, my face wash. This is what I use in the morning and I really, really love it. And then at nighttime, this is what I use, night relaxing. I really like this one too. I feel like one little pump does well and it evenly distributes all over my face. And then I do love this one. I love this so, 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 so much. It's the same as Blackhead Clearing, and I really, really love that. Um, I think this is like one of my must-haves, like definitely. Um, I would love this for a stocking stuffer. I do love these two as well, um, but I really, really love this one because I feel it. And weird, weirdly, like it doesn't even um, dry out my skin. I'm gonna turn off my fan so you can hear me. I hope you can hear me. <laughs> they say bathrooms have like the best acoustics, so I hope it does. All right, um, I mean, I don't have the best skin, so I don't know. I just want to share this with you. I know it's like a weird vlog. I don't do beauty videos. I don't do any of that, but this is my night stuff. So I have my favorite brush here. It's an eco brush. I got it from Marshalls and it's the Eye on Beauty. Um, I'm sure there's like some really nice things out there that are like name brand and really nice, but this one does it for me. It has a little silicone brush, which is really nice. Um, that side helps to exfoliate your skin. And then it has the microfiber brushes, which I really, really like too, because not all brushes are the same. I had one brush that kind of like scratched me and it left like a scratch right here. And yeah, I do have like a lot of dots on my face. So I don't have perfect skin. My complexion is not even, I have no makeup on at all right now. I do have like multi-discoloration on my skin, but I feel like it's just part of my lupus. I do get red a lot in here. I do get the butterfly rash effect. Um, and again, that's from my lupus. And then I do get dry skin all in here, but I think that's from the treatment that I had for my cancer. And then um, I do have like beauty spots, I guess. That's what I call them. They're like freckles on Navajos I don't know that's I don't know maybe I'm the only one who has that <laughs> but that's kind of what I have going and recently I have a stress pimple here and a stress pimple there so that's what my face looks like I know it looks like I have really nice skin but I don't I don't all right so basically I wash my face like any other person I damp my face and the number one thing too when you wash your face like don't really rub your skin don't pull it down so much um tend to go up like brush upwards if you pull your skin down so if you cry and you like pull down you're actually pressing on your skin's elasticity and you're like creating a lot of a lot of um, damage i know it sounds weird but that's kind of what i heard attributes to wrinkles and i know wrinkles for a big part are just hereditary and you can't get away from them um i have wrinkles see that like that when i um, scrunch my face or anything i get wrinkles and it's just part of it so it's part of life and you kind of have to like embrace those things you're beautiful with wrinkles and without i have to remind myself to go up just like i'm telling you I have to remind myself to be so gentle on my skin and to wash my face with clean hands. So now my hands are a little bit wet. I just dab like a little bit. Oops, 
just a little bit like that. A little bit goes a long ways. So I put in my fingers, I do that, and then I just massage it in a circular motion on my face. I wish I could give you like better um, footage, but I can't. All right, so this is what I do. I get my um, microfiber side and I wet it. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna move my camera around, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> but I wet it and then I just gently go in circular motions. I go one way and then the other way and I just kind of lightly do it so it's not hard at all. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And then just keep doing that. Then I wet it again and then I go again. It's like repetitive. Uh, and if I have like a pimple, like I have that blemish there, then I avoid going on it so hard. My skin is like pretty sensitive, um, so I like the products that I have. I did try Aveeno, but Aveeno seemed not, it didn't seem like it was making a difference for me, just because like my skin gets dried out, it's sensitive. Um, I don't really have a problem with an oily um, complexion, so I don't know how that would work. So after I do that, basically for what, like two minutes? I clean it out. I want to make sure I rinse it out really, really good. Next thing I do is I get this side, my microfiber side, I wet it, and I just go in circles. I like this side. It gets a little, um, a little drippy, so you have to be careful. like a huge component also when you're cleaning your face like people forget under their chin I don't know why people forget that like love on that area too I don't have an automatic spinning brush some places have that but I feel like a lot of them are way too fast so I'd rather have just the spinless meaning it doesn't spin and I control the spinning I rinse it out the same way I did the, my, um, the other side, the silicone side, and then I put it back in its little lid. It has like a, a catch tray. And then I just, um, I just kind of go over my face very gently, very gentle. If I had eyeshadow on, that would be different. I don't have a makeup remover care um, routine. Let me get my towel. Sorry to get my towel. I love yellow, guys. It's like my favorite thing. Um, oh, really quickly. I'm in the middle of planning my daughter's eighth birthday party. And I've had people on my Instagram who are so sweet, who are asking me for my address, like a mailing address, so they can send her a gift. So I just, you guys are so sweet. I love you guys. I mean, not because you're sending a gift, because your heart is just so thoughtful. And I had one person also ask if they could send a card. And I was like, for sure you could do that. Like, that's so sweet. Okay, so now that I'm like just patting it dry, you should never be harsh with your face and rub on it. So I always just pat it dry. Sometimes I like lightly rub like that, but it's good. So my face is like really clean. Let me do this back. So now I'm going to show you, if you're wondering about my husband, like I shouldn't even show it, but his is the Neutrogena Men. So that was also a nice one. I used it on my face as well, actually, when we were traveling and I forgot my set, I used my husband's and it was, it was okay. It wasn't harsh on my face. Okay. I believe men should also have a good care routine too. If you're looking for like a nice moisturizer, this is a really good moisturizer. Not only um, for my husband, but like for me, I really love this one. So it is a face lotion with sunscreen. You want to make sure that your um, moisturizer has sunscreen in it. And I really like that. Plus this one smells so, 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 so good. So men, um, yeah. Your self-care is important too. Don't think that it's only for women because it's not. And us ladies like our men to take care of themselves. So there you go. This is my favorite, my favorite. And this one, I'm almost out. I need to buy another one. You can see how thin it is. Um, but yeah, this one is a dual action moisturizer. 
um, it's oil free and it moisturizes your skin. It treats and helps prevent pimples. So right here it says moisturizes dry skin. I don't know if you could read that or if it's backwards. Mm, but yeah, I really like this one. It's called Manuka Honey Face Oil. It has jojoba and vitamin E. So basically this locks in moisturizer. It's supposed to really help with dry skin. It softens it and gives you a dewy complexion. So I can't talk tonight. Um, but yeah, this is what I put on. So I'm not running out because I recently got this one. This one I really love to do. Again, what I do is I just take the dropper like that. So you have to be careful because it does run like that. And I just put one, two, three, four, five. I know that one I do like a lot of drops, but you'll see. <clears throat> you'll see why. I try to remind myself to go really lightly with my skin and just kind of rub it all. If I'm not going, okay, hold on, that's Koei. If I'm not going anywhere for the day, I'll definitely put it on my face or I will put coconut oil on my face because coconut oil really likes to draw out um, impurities. So that's what I do and I put it on my neck. I know. And then I just put it on my earlobes. I don't forget my earlobes. I try not to forget my earlobes. So, and then I just kind of rub it out very gently. You can hear Koei because he wants. Yeah! stop being so fun I love you okay but give mama a break don't give me a heart attack all right so that's my face that's my night skincare routine and then I like to sleep with my hair braided sometimes because it does less damage also I should say that a good tip for nighttime is to have a silk pillow if you have not slept with a silk pillow sheet oh my goodness you need to put your pillow encase it in a silk pillowcase because silk pillowcases help with um you know sorry sorry it helps with decreasing wrinkles or just build up or acne and it really feels so nice. I really like it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's so different. I think ladies could appreciate it. I hope that men appreciate it too because you work out in weather conditions, meaning if it's wind, snow, colds, if you have all the weather there, you have to take care of your skin. So for everyone too. And also drink a lot of water. That helps. So these are the products that I use as well as the Manuka honey. But I hope you guys have a really good night. And don't forget, I got this at Marshalls. You can buy it anywhere. It just depends. I'm not really privy to any like top brand or anything. Unless I see a major difference. And I haven't so far. So that's how it is. Okay, guys. Have a good night. Have a really good night. Bye. Bye. Say what you wanna say to me now